everyone welcome to my channel so today i am very excited to be unboxing the literary book club box for march of 2024. now if you're unfamiliar with the literary book club box this is a quarterly book club subscription and this is a luxury literary subscription which i love kind of like la, 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 la. Um, is that alliteration i think so so it's kind of a book uh it's kind of a subscription for old souls and romantics in that they have beautiful classic books in this subscription and again it is quarterly so every three months so each quarter they send you a gorgeous collectible edition of a classic book and then you also get thoughtful gifts that kind of make the experience magical all the gifts are wrapped and they correlate with like the page number so for example on page 23 she puts on a pair of sunglasses you may open something and you get a pair of sunglasses it's very really fun and it makes kind of like an immersive reading experience the box itself is $74.99 a quarter plus shipping this box is sent to me free for review and I do have a discount code down below where you can get a discount with your first box the March box that I'm unboxing today is sold out but you can get on the waitlist so I'll leave a link down below if you want to get on a waitlist for the next box with that welcome back to all the sub box lovers out there welcome if you're new my name is Katrina and on my channel I unbox lots of different subscription boxes including some fun like book boxes and things like that so if you like these subscription box videos definitely make sure to give this one a thumbs up make sure you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss out on future uploads and let's dive in I am so happy that you're here with me today unboxing this box. I think the last box I got from them was like at the fall box and oh, I love the book. It's just a gorgeous book. So I'm so curious to see what the March one is gonna be. When you open up the box, that is what it looks like. Okay, so you do get a little um, wax sealed envelope. It looks like this might be a Jane Austen book because it says, I shall be miserable if I have not an excellent library, Jane Austen, or maybe not, maybe that's just a book quote. I don't know, let's open this up and see. Oh, okay, so it's not by Jane Austen. That was just a Jane Austen quote. Uh, quote. So, The Mysterious Affair at Styles. Um, so it's written by Agatha Christie in 1920 and is the first of her novels to feature, um, I'm probably gonna butcher this, Hercule, Hercule Poirot. Uh, the small fastidious Belgian is one of her most iconic characters and among the most famous fictional detectives in the world. The story features many of the elements that have become icons of the golden age of detective fiction, largely due to Christine's influence. Uh, it's set in a large, isolated country manor. There are half a dozen suspects, most of whom are hiding facts about themselves. I hope you enjoy the book as much as I do. Um, oh, this is so exciting. That that sounds like a book that's right up my alley. All right, so all the gifts are wrapped up. I will also say just like the envelope and the paper that that was printed on are super nice. Um, the book itself is here. So let's peek at it. <gasps> oh, look at how beautiful this is. You've got kind of like the foiling going on with like some um, golds and greens and you get the oh, beautiful. So yeah, oh, this is really fun. Um, now it's a little, it's a skinny little book, which I'm actually excited about. Um, I think the last book that I got from them was a little bit thicker. So it probably just depends on the month. You do get this beautiful green um, page marker and the pages are like, they're, um, they're not matte, they're like satin, not satin. They're just like, they're a nice kind of like, they're not the regular paper material that most books are. And so this is really, really nice. The book quality, like you get really, really nice copies of these books. So I cannot wait to read this one. I, this is gonna look stunning on a bookshelf. I recently switched around my bookshelf situation um, to fit, you know, as y'all know, I got a cat recently and so now I have a cat tree and so instead of having two shorter bookshelves, I now have a nice big one. And so I'm like, ooh, I'm gonna have to figure out where this one's gonna go. Um, or I might just, it's so pretty, I might just have it sit out. Um, this is very exciting. So this is the book itself. I think you do also get like a bookmark, which I'm thinking is what this is. Yes, it could be used as a bookmark marks it says if the fact will not fit the theory let the theory go i got the christie and it's really beautiful with the florals there and then you do also get like a little signature thing it's not signed i guess this is but i think or is that what you put like oh property of is this what you put your name in it i can't remember how that works um, and then there's also a little sticker in it. It says, you gave too much rain to your imagination. Imagination is a good servant and a bad master. So these must be quotes from the book. Now I'm obviously going through this not having read the book before doing this. So um, it might be a little bit more challenging for me to know what each thing is for. We'll try to kind of figure that out as we go through. But I will also say if you're getting this book and you don't want to be spoiled about what the gifts are, 
then maybe don't watch this video. <laughs> now, you do get a little card that says no spoilers here, but talks a little bit about like what you may get or what pages or something to do while you read. On the back of it, it does tell you exactly what you get just to make sure that you weren't missing anything. But I do like it that it like they put it in the box in a way that you would not have seen the back of it and get gotten spoiled. You do also get a little art print. This one's it's wrapped, so I won't take it out quite yet. So it says instinct is a marvelous thing. It can neither be explained nor ignored. Really fun, oh, you're seeing my ring light there, but it all kind of has the same theming, which is this beautiful floral, which is fun, because March, we're kind of getting into spring. I also love the kind of like green too, since we're in March, I love the theming. All right, we're gonna open the first gift, which is a while you read gift. Ooh, this is fun. So you get some Pop Daddy popcorn, you get a little treat to eat while you're reading. So this is some butter popcorn, hand seasoned in small batches, made with ruby red kernels and pure olive oil, nothing artificial. Blue kind of free. It's a really fun little popcorn. So you can curl up your book. You got your little snack here to taste out. I love popcorn, so this is very exciting. All right, up next, we're gonna open the gift for page 47. Ooh, we have some Rocky Mountain hot cocoa. Um, premium mix, just add water, and it makes two mugs. This is from PD Bird, crafted in colorful Colorado. So a nice little hot cocoa moment. I love hot cocoa, so I'm very here for this. We got some little hot cocoa, a little bit of popcorn. And honestly, this is, you can take the sticker off and just reuse this bag, which is also very nice. Up next, we have a gift for page 58. Okay, we had another little pouch. I'm like, oh, what's this gonna be? This is a bath salt soak in Meyer lemon. Y'all know I'm a bath product girly. I love taking baths. And this is from Three Sisters Apothecary from Sonoma County, California. So it says revitalizing Meyer lemon bath salt soak refreshes and renews to gently pamper and soothe the body. Crisp Meyer lemon awakens the body as a key in, um, actives of agave, lemon balm, and golden seal hydrate and mineral rich ocean and Epsom salts restore and revitalize. So love a little bath soak moment. All right, then on to page 144. This gift like has like gold or not gold, green foiling on it. It says you gave too much rain to your imagination. Imagination is a good servant and a bad bastard. So again, one of those quotes there, but it's like really cool that it's like on the paper like that. Ooh, this is exciting. Um, it's another book and this is the League of Lady Poisoners illustrated true stories of dangerous women. <gasps> Ooh, is this like women murderers or poisoners throughout the years? Oh my God, we're gonna have to open this. It is like sealed. It does have like the green foiling there. Ooh, okay. So it talks about different women who poison people. This is, it's like very coolly illustrated. Okay, this is really cool. Um, yeah, I don't really know. I don't know much about this, but this does, it seems very interesting. I mean, I know from like re, like re, like true crime stuff that like women are more likely to use poison than men are, I guess. I don't know. So this is really interesting. Okay. She lists all her citing and the, the sources in the back of the book too. Okay, this is really fun. Beautiful book. I feel like during Halloween time, like using this as table decor could be beautiful and I just, Look at like two gorgeous books in this box. I am very excited. And then last but not least, there's still one more little gift here. It says open when the last page has been read. Okay, we've got a little rollerball maybe. And this says, it is the brain, the little gray cells on which one must rely. A thoughtful craft blend of aromatherapy oils to help keep your gray cells working optimally, mon ami. Okay, is it like, it's got rosemary, lemon, bergamot, peppermint, and a base of cocos nucifera oil. All right, let's give it a little sniff. Ooh, uh, it's really pepperminty. I feel like I smell a lot of the peppermint. That smells really nice. It's basically like an aromatherapy essential oil, little rollerball, so really, really cute. All right, and that is everything in the Literary Book Club box for March. This box is so great. Like, very high quality products, the experience. Like, I love a box that has a really nicely planned and curated experience, and you absolutely have that with this box. Obviously, I wasn't sitting here and reading, but if you were, it'd be even better uh, as you're reading the box. But just even, like, the theming, you know, you've got the florals here, you've got the florals there, the quotes, all that. There's so much that's thought through. 
and I just I think it's very well th thought through the gifts are so nice the book is they're stunning beautiful beautiful books even this extra book that we got in it is just stunning and if you are somebody who loves to read and you do want kind of that luxury and you want that immersive experience I highly recommend this box and there's a reason why every time I'm unboxing it it's already been sold out because people really love this box too so again I will leave a link down below in case you want to sign up for the wait list um, I do have a discount code once you do get off the wait list if you want a discount on um, your subscription because that, it's always a wait list I haven't been able to actually check my code to see how much it's for but if you know let me know <laughs> definitely let me know your thoughts down in the comments below though what do you think of this box I just think it's so 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 much fun so let me know your thoughts down below if you like this video definitely make sure to give it a thumbs up make sure you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss out on future uploads and i'll see you in my next video